Meantime, the spotlight continues to burn on Melissa Carone, who Giuliani brought before Michigan officials and then claimed to considerable mockery to have proof of voter fraud. She was lampooned by Saturday Night Live over the weekend, and now we're speaking exclusively with a woman who says she's afraid of Carone. She's President Trump's star witness, and she's either a whistleblower heroine or a figure of total mockery. And I signed something saying that if I'm wrong, I can go to prison. Did you? Melissa Carone's train wreck testimony about so-called election fraud in Michigan was just parodied on SNL. I personally saw hundreds, if not thousands, of dead people vote. But 44-year-old Jessica Stackpool doesn't find anything about Melissa Carone funny at all. I have been to court with her, I'd have to say approximately, probably... 40 to 50 times. In 2018, Melissa Carone was charged with obscenity for allegedly emailing sexually explicit videos to her fiance's ex-wife, Jessica Stackpool. There were three different video clips. Um, they're approximately three to seven minutes long. Carone pled guilty to a lesser charge, which was dismissed earlier this year after she completed probation. What was your reaction when you saw her on TV? I cried because I knew that it was only going to be a matter of time before somebody started digging into her criminal stuff and then all of, you know, the last three years of my life um, would, would be brought to the surface. What did you think about the, the way she was acting? I think that she saw this as an opportunity for some notoriety. She is quite a character. She's been spoofed by SNL and other outlets. Is that the real Melissa? A hundred percent. That's her every day. That is Melissa Carone. Did you do you even know the answer to that? No, I guess it's, I'm trying to get to the bottom zero, of this here. Zero. Zero. There's zero. Melissa Carone denies these allegations, and tomorrow we'll be speaking with her for her side of the story. So be sure to join us for that.